What's up, YouTube? Sea Lord here with another deck profile. This here is my updated version of Draco Pals. I crossed the list between a Japanese variant of this deck I saw a few months back and my old variant. So, see how this goes. We're going to start this off with three Pendulum Sorcerer. One of the best cards in the deck. Two Performo Pal King Bear. King Bear is pretty good, lets you recycle your level 7s. One Light Phoenix. Light Phoenix is for when your opponent tries to make their OTKs and stuff like that. He's essentially Battle Fader for the deck. Two Odd Eyes Unicorn. One Guitardle, one Joker, one Swing Cobra, one Silver Claw, two Lizard Draw, Monkey Board, and that's it for the Pendulum Performo Pals. For the rest of my Pendulum style cards, we got one. Odd Eyes, one Eccentric, one Chiron. Chiron's very good. Uh, gets rid of cards that you don't really want to see on your opponent's side of the field. And if you use it right, you can reuse your uh, Joker, which is very useful. One Lector, two Masters, one Luster, and one Vector. Alright, now that's it for all the Pendulum Monsters. Now on to the non-Pendulum Monsters. One Performo Pal Slight Hand. Two Long Phone Bull. And two Second Donkeys. This deck has mad search power now. Okay, on to the Spells and Traps. Two Mystical Space Typhoons. Two fusion substitutes. One Rageki. One instant fusion. One soul charge. One Draco face off. That's it for the spells. Onto the traps. Solemn strike. Solemn warning. Treacherous trap hole. And one bottomless trap hole. So that's it for the main deck. 40 cards in the main deck. Now on to the extra. One Odd Eyes Vortex. One Norden. Two Dynaster. So the cool thing about Fusion Substitute is that, let's say I needed Vortex again or I need Dynaster again, I can banish that Fusion Substitute to draw a card and then return one back to the extra deck, which is really nice and very useful. One Ignister. Sadly, he's at one. Uh, I could play more than one. I obviously would. One number 38. One Photon Strike Bouncer. Because now you can consistently get rank 6 out with the deck. So might as well run one. And by far the best one. One Utopia Lightning. One regular Utopia. Castell. Diamond Dyer, Magister, Digusto Emerald, so that you can recycle, you know, Ignister and stuff like that. One Abyss Dweller, and one Trap Tricks for Flasia. That's it for the extra. Now, finally, onto the side. Two Majesty's Fiend. Uh, I'll be honest, I use Majesty's Fiend in everything. So you, any deck profile of mine you see, you'll probably see them pop up. Three Maxis. Two Ghost Ogres and Snow Rabbit. One Jinzo. So, this is just because I love Jinzo and I didn't really feel like running Decrees. And, you know, it's actually, it's got a pretty good offensive so it can be used... Pretty nicely, you can tribute summon it, so if the opponent has a domain lock, 
you can get over the domain lock, which is nice. Two effect veilers, two iron wall, one soldering, you know, hurt burning abyss, hurt phantom knights, things like that. And two mask of restricts. And that's it. So that's the entire deck. 40 cards again. By far one of my favorite decks to use. This is Sea Lord, signing out.